Continuing coverage on a story we've been following for a, quite some time now. Catalytic converter thefts they are skyrocketing here in Texas, and it's a trend we've been exposing now for years. A new law is aiming to curb that, and as the News 4i team's Jordan Elder explains, advocates say it just might work. SB 224 is now law in the state of Texas. Harsher penalties are on the way for catalytic converter thieves. A new law putting millions of dollars into solving and preventing the crime. But for Spencer Cole, it's coming too late. Yeah, I understand the lack of resources, but it was a big deal because it cut off my only source of income. You know, it wasn't just they stole my catalytic converter. They pretty much stole my uh, my job from me. His catalytic converter was stolen off his truck twice. The device targeted for the precious metals inside. Since we spoke to him last year, Cole has gotten a new job and a new car and he hopes the new law can protect others from thieves. There will be a lot less reward for them to actually go out and steal catalytic converters from people. More Texans are finding themselves in this situation. The data company Ben Verified ran the numbers from the National Insurance Crime Bureau. Thefts are up more than 10,000% from 2019. You heard that right, 10,000%. It is going to create more accountability in the, the industry. Michael Horton works with PGM of Texas, a catalytic converter recycler in San Marcos. Now you're looking at serious penalties if you continue to go on this path of, of stealing catalytic converters. They were pushing for these changes, which require more licensing and documentation if you've got more than one device. This law takes effect September 1st. There are cages and devices you can use to protect your catalytic converter, but they won't stop theft altogether. They will, however, buy you some more time. Reporting live, I'm Jordan Elder, News 4 San Antonio. All right, Jordan, thank you for that. Now, this law is also expected to put millions of dollars towards solving and preventing catalytic converter theft. And here's a look at that breakdown. A state board predicts about $54 million in revenue by 2025.